welcome back. Thank you so much for all your help. Yeah, they've been aces. Yeah, real pros. Hey, Clug. Sorry about those two. They can be a bit intense. Really, I don't know why. I'm off work till Friday, then off Saturday, Sunday, so Monday, and Tuesday. I hate to ask for anything else, Hell yeah. but this election is really close. And, well, keeping the G3 out of Blim, it's really going to help me lock this in. Do you think you could, you know, deal with Dr. Giblets? Well, yeah, no, I mean, we, that's what we want to do. Doing you know, good, but, you. But uh, it's just the trail went dead. A dead end? Oh, no, we can't have that. Let me just leave this map data right here on my desk. Not sure what might be on it. Oh, that's how we get to Dr. Giblets? Whoa, whoa, even if this map data did take you to Dr. I'm Giblets, right. we're not 100% sure it would be his actual base. You'll still need to do some detective work. Fuck yeah. All right, then we just kick uh. the door down, burst our way in there, find him, grab him by the neck. Hey, hey, hey. I can't officially tell you to do that. Not if I want to win this next election, at least. <laughs> Good luck out there, bounty hunter. Uh, we will do our best. Find us that fucking Dr. Giblets piece of shit. Vamoose, you goose. Thanks for helping our dad. We love our dad, Clug. They're my kids, yeah. Forgot to mention that. <laughs> Good boys, too. What do you think of our dad? Isn't he gr This is where our dad works. He's a really hard worker. Someday all this will be ours. But not soon. He should only live and be well. How about this office, huh? This is where our dad works. Someday it'll be where we work. Well, that's not how politics works, but you get the idea. Make I like a tree and leaf. A leaf. The Godfather. Make Holy like a, moly, you know. Stromboli, that movie was good. Bam, boom. Francis Ford Coppola. He's back, baby. You're doing great work. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Genetics occasionally skips a generation. We may not look like him, but we like him. You know, we've been tailing you for a while. Next time you play the game, look for us. You won't see us unless we want you to, because we're in stealth mode. Know what that means? What would be cool is if you see out there in the Magistrate background. Magistrate Clug came through. He, he pointed us right to Dr. Giblets. That's great. I kind of regret not voting for him. Now get out there and kill Giblets. Gary and Jill went up the hill to fetch a pail of water. Gary fell in love and broke his crown. And Jill came tumbling after. Gary and Jill went up the hill to fetch a pail of water. Gary fell down and broke his crown. And Jill came tumbling after. <laughs> 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 What? It won't let me select anything. Weird. Make a cool animated background for somebody's phone. Quit moving around. Got him. More G three. Let's fucking go.
Whoa, it looks like things have developed in a sort of weird way over here. Welcome to Highway Village. Our currency here is tires, and we sacrifice our younglings to the Lord Asphaltia, High God of the Way. It's At first up. we were scared. How did we end up here? Where were we? Should we leave our highway? And it turns out the answers in order as I asked them were, I don't know, I don't know, and definitely not. It is true, we used to hate each other, honking and shouting, fuck you, back and forth, like animals, but now, we have found community and love. Hey, I'm the youngest one left alive. That means they're gonna sacrifice me to Lord Asphaltia tomorrow. I'm not too excited about it, to be honest, actually. <laughs> Hey, I'm not even that much younger than everyone else. I'm 45 years old. Stop trying to kill I just everyone. happen to be Jesus. the youngest by a couple of months. I know everyone's Let's happy, just chill on but we did a kill second. a lot of children in the name of a god we only made up what within the last week. Deal? We're Isn't not killing that crazy? Let's do it. Hello, friend. My old life was flawed. Now I live the way of the highway. Hey, calm down. We don't need to shoot everybody. Lord Asphaltia yeah, provides help. By which I mean sometimes a mite scurries up into our territory. We eat it and it's so, so we don't die. They taste awful, but it helps us not die. No, I'm not shooting this one. You know, I one. didn't believe in Lord Asphaltia a few days ago, but I mean, since then we, we've made him up and I'm like, uh, I, I'm a believer for sure and for sure and for... You're okay. blessed by Lord Asphaltia. shot you know let's play snotty soccer Fuck you! 
talking, little freaks? Incoming! My trick hole's ready to blow. What's up? Problem. What do we have here? What the hell do I get over there? I don't think I can latch onto that. I don't see any bugs I can bring out. Confused. Oh. Keep hearing about hyper bong smoke humans. Uh, oh, thank God. Thank God so much. Oh, that's messed up. I, I'm, I'm, I'm losing consciousness. Oh, 
Oh my God, what, what, what happened? Haji, you had to do it. You, you had to put him out of his misery. It was like a really annoying horse with a broken leg, you, you know? It, it, do you understand? Is there an equivalent to broken leg? You, you following here? Okay, so is this Dr. Giblets' base? Where, where the hell is he? Oh, I'm sure we'll be able to find Dr. Giblets with just a little bit of detective work. Let's look around for clues. Jesus Christ! Okay, okay, fine. Oh, that's a lot of dead bodies. What do you think happened in here? Whatever it was, it's not a good situation for everyone who died. But it's great for us detectives because we need a good mystery to solve. Now go scan stuff. Someone was killing G3 mercs. You know what? That makes sense. Everyone hates the G3. I bet people try to kill them all the time. I mean, look at you. That's what you're doing. Mm. Hmm, a destroyed drone. Looks like it was deployed for combat. Nothing fishy there, that's what they're used for, that's what drones are for, they're for combat, that's not weird to see a destroyed drone. Looks like your typical work desk, nothing too crazy, uh, uh, you know, best I can guess is someone interrupted Dr. Giblets while he was doing experiments, I don't know, I'm just throwing stuff at the wall here. Okay, yeah, I think I'm getting a sense of what happened here. Someone beat us to the punch. They attacked Dr. Giblets and all his men. Huh, we need more information. Let me hack the door so we can go deeper and look for more clues. All right then, let's, let's keep moving. Howdy there, cowboys. Uh, oh shit, sorry, wrong bit, wrong bit. I mean, howdy there, detectives. Ooh, this looks like the lab where Dr. Giblets did his experiments. There's got to be something helpful in here. Let's get to scanning. We got this, Pseudo! Get the fuck out of here! These must be old Hyperbong prototypes. Way jankier than the ones they're selling at the High on Life store. Well, you know, we just pointed these out. Now we can move on to the next thing. The trash can Queer, things? Look at all these drone heads. Dr. Giblets was an expert at creating cybernetic organisms, but we already knew that. You know, I don't think this is a very helpful clue. I do think it's neat, though. It's cool to look at fucked up drone heads. Thanks for showing me this. Was he doing experiments on his own henchmen? Jesus Christ, that's fucked up, right? Yeah, that's fucked up. I know it's fucked up. I don't know why I asked. I knew it was fucked up. Dr. Giblets must have been losing his mind. All right, here's my new theory. Dr. Giblets was even more twisted than we could ever imagine. He was torturing his own henchmen. He wasn't right in the head. Although I guess that's what Douglas did too, so maybe that's normal for the G3. Maybe he was normal. No way to know unless we go deeper. I'm hacking the next door. All right, I got no fucking idea what this room is, but I'm sure there's more clues in here, so go, go find more clues, baby.
Are these second place trophies? They're trophies for, for what? Science? Just science in general? Mm. Do they really give out second place trophies for science? Jeez, it looks like Dr. Diblitz was pissed he didn't get first place in, in science. Ooh boy, did Dr. Giblets write this? He was really paranoid, huh? He really thought people were trying to kill him. And you know what? Uh, he, he was right, because that's exactly what we're here to do. So, okay, he was right. Not crazy. Normal guy. Oh shit, that's a g Gatlian. A regular old Gatlian doesn't look like it's in good health at all. Probably should just let it be, honestly. Aha, so that's our murder weapon. Dr. Giblets must have used that modified Gatlian to attack his men. It's pretty powerful. Did a lot of did a lot of damage. It'd be great if we could somehow get that Gatlian for ourselves. You think that's gonna happen? Uh, who knows? Let's find out. Okay, I think we finally cracked this case. Dr. Giblets really did go insane. He was paranoid that someone was after him, so he killed his own men. While you were wasting time doing detective work, I was busy scanning the area for Dr. Giblets and decrypting the password on his security systems. Now you can just follow the waypoint right to him. Wait, so we didn't have to find any of those clues? Yep, sorry. I just love detective mode so much, I didn't want you to stop using it. Now go kill Dr. Giblets. Why can't we have the gun? Giblets. Uh, that was very anticlimactic, but I'm not, I'm not, I'm not complaining. Jesus Christ, that was the easiest one yet. All right, let me at him. Doctor Giblets status report: No life cells detected. Entering full security lockdown. Uh -oh. this pre-recorded message, it means you've successfully managed to murder one of the greatest minds in all of super science. Congratulations, you killed me. But I knew this day would come and I was prepared for this moment. Now see if you can survive my retribution from beyond the grave. Okay, shit yes, we do get to fight. Nice to kill something guilt-free, you know? Krubus, Krubus, Krubus. 
was always complaining about being the lowest rung on the G3 ladder. You thought you could kill me and take my spot at to the top, didn't you? Well, think again, because... Well, you did kill me, actually, but... I'm gonna kill you back! Sweezy's always the right choice. that after all those years stuck behind mountains of paperwork, you finally got to get your hands on the again, just like you wanted. I really am proud of you, but you picked the wrong dirt to get dirty with. I'm bad with analogies. Krubis, could it actually be about the time that I slept with your wife? Whoa. I asked her to divorce you and marry me instead. And then I made her do an experiment for me and she died in that process. And you swore revenge against me for the rest of the days? Could be that? I feel like it's probably not, but I just want to make sure. I know you can't tell me because I'm dead. But soon you can tell me. <laughs> hey, blast that pesky son. I mean, you know you're just gonna die, right? Really? If you're still hearing this, you're taking a long time to fight this wave. Or die. You can also die. Okay, I, I think that's probably it. Alright, if you're still alive, you can't be Krubus. Krubus was too weak. I would have killed him. No, no, you must be someone else. But who is it? Who killed me? Was it you, Douglas? You never told me your last name! Did the whole G3 hate this guy? Fuck shit up! You're evil! You're not to listen to you! 
Forgive me for making you go through all of that. You can leave now. Have a good day. Giblets out. R.I.P. Giblets. Wow, okay. Good, 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 good work. Uh, I think we can get back out through the trapdoor now. the galleon as I continue to study these humans I find them to be more complex than I ever could have expected initially I saw great potential in both the Fergals and the Gatlians but now I see how foolish I was those were nothing but dead ends Humans, however, humans are going to change everything. God damn, what the fuck was the G3 doing with this guy? Oh, uh, yeah, you know what? We, we, we should probably grab that Gatlian, you know? Is he even alive? You know what? Let's take him back to Gene. Gene knows. He can fix, get him all fixed up. I just wanted to say, you know, today really meant a lot to me, and um, uh, 
God. Let's do it. That's so fucking hard. Um, your free trial of detective mode is up. So see you later. Bye. Oh, thank God. Okay, bounty hunter, you go through the menus. You find that detective mode. You shut it the fuck off. Never again. Okay, I'm serious. Delete it. J delete it. And if we, if you can't do it, we, we, we go, we go to, you know, we, it's a whole mission. It'll be a whole DLC mission. Every last peso we've ever earned, we pay whoever it is to delete this fucking detective mode bullshit. You know, a whole DLC story about it that, that we'll charge $45 for. And it'll only be like an hour of content because fuck you. You bitch! No, I'm just kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. We wouldn't do that. We wouldn't do that. We're not gonna do that. Weird. If I'm reading this right, it seems like that famous scientist, Dr. Gurgula, was researching Gatlians? Buy six items from the vendor. What? Okay. See? It's not so easy figuring out where these bozos are. Let it go! Come on over, let's bow wow! And Jill can come like after. At night, when the mask is off, I look at. So weird.